guys welcome back to another video today i'm going to be doing a clean out of my closet declutter reorganize kind of like revamp some of my closet and the clothes in there and some of the shoes as well if you're new here please make sure that you hit that red subscribe button followed by the bell for notifications that's the way that you will be able to see my videos pop up in your feed or on your phone anytime I upload new videos. I have a bunch of stuff that I actually need to post on my Poshmark. You guys know I love Poshmark and this video is sponsored by Poshmark, which I'm super excited about. So I will be getting rid of clothes and posting them on my Poshmark. Right now, my Poshmark is like almost completely empty because before we moved, I cleared everything out. Like if it wasn't selling, I just cleared it out. I think I have one thing on my Poshmark, in my Poshmark closet, but I have like a pile down here and then I'm going to get rid of some more stuff. And if it's not nice, I'll just send it to Goodwill. But if it's nice enough, I'll put it on my Poshmark. Now I like decluttering my closet by using Marie Kondo's style, which is like pulling everything out and touching each piece to see which piece sparks joy. And if it doesn't spark joy, then you get rid of it. So I don't know if you guys have ever heard of her, but she is really amazing. I have used some of her methods for years now. So let's get into decluttering the closet. So I'm starting off with putting on a fun show love that show and then i'm heading into my closet this is kind of how things look they're in rainbow order so now i'm just going to be pulling everything out of the closet and putting it all on my bed So now my side of the closet is empty. I gotta get rid of this stuff actually. Um, and then I think I only have one pair of shoes I'm gonna get rid of and I think it is this pair and I don't know if they're nice enough to go up on Poshmark. I don't know, I need to take a look and check out all my clothes and you're probably wondering why I like messed up the colors, but I'm going to, oh, don't mind my laundry over there. I need to fold that and put that away. <laughs> um, so I need to reorganize my clothes because it's starting to get on my nerves because I can't figure out where my short sleeve shirts are. And now that it's heating up, I'm like, I feel like all I can find is sweaters. So I want to reorganize and put it by like, Jackets, sweaters, long sleeve, short sleeve, tank tops, etc. you know. So I'm saying goodbye to the rainbow for a little while. <laughs> I just want to switch it up. So now I'm heading in and I'm going to be just working on all of my decluttering and getting rid of stuff, sending stuff to Goodwill, putting stuff in my Poshmark closet. And that is what I always do when I declutter my closet. So I'm going to chat with you a little bit about Poshmark and make sure you check out my description box so that you can download Poshmark, whether you're in the US, Canada or Australia, you can use the link in my description box and shop either from my closet or from your favorite brands. So I truly think that Poshmark is the easiest way to sell items to clean out your closet. I always do this. I think that it is genius and such a fun way to look at what other people have and get rid of what you have and make a little bit of extra cash. You can also find amazing deals and shop from thousands of brands up to 70% off retail prices. Poshmark also has luxury brands available at affordable prices with complimentary authentication for purchases of $500 or more. So if you guys happen to buy any of the clothes that I list in my closet, make sure you tag me over on Instagram. I'd love to see them either on you or in your home. And I just think that that's super fun. So a lot of the items that I listed, I listed at like 14 bucks, but honestly, what I've learned with Poshmark is I tend to aim high and then I have space to negotiate. So if you wanna make me an offer on something, 
most likely I will take it as long as I can make a little bit of profit off of it. So make sure you check out my closet and just make me an offer. Don't look at something and think that the price is firm. Okay, so I just had to switch out my battery grab a trash bag so I could have something to put like all my Goodwill stuff in. I wanted to show you a couple of the things I'm gonna be putting on my Poshmark. This is a pink blush shirt that ties in the front and this was like one of my favorite shirts for a long time. This is like a really pretty pink kimono and I just like love how cute and flowy it is but I never reach for this kimono anymore. Like, I just don't wear it, so gotta get rid of it. And then I actually love this color, but I just don't really wear it often, so I'm gonna get rid of this shirt. And then I'm gonna be listing this gray sweater. It's like a long sweater, and I think I got it from Nordstrom Rack, and it has like a slit up the side on each side. It's super cute, I'm just like, Again, I just like don't reach for it. And then I'm going to list this MTV shirt, which I love it, but I just never wear it. I don't know, there's just, you know how you get like stuck in a rut and you just wear certain things? This is just not one of my favorites. So I'm gonna get rid of it. And then there's this really cute like um, matching jumpsuit. It's like a turtleneck kind of, I don't know how to explain it. And then it's kind of cropped and it has like matching pants and they're like joggers, but um, I'm just like, it just doesn't work for me. Like it's a medium, so I'm, I'm gonna list that on Poshmark as well. So now I'm just going through and I'm gonna be putting things in the order that I want them in my closet. So on the right are tank tops and then to the left of those are t-shirts or like short sleeve shirts and then long sleeve shirts and then sweatshirts and jackets all the way on the left. Um, so this just is a system that works for me. I don't know, I struggled a little bit cause there's like certain things that I'm like, oh these aren't really like in those columns but I just made certain piles for those like for my workout clothes I made a specific pile I put them in a different spot in my closet which I'm excited for because I'm always trying to find my workout clothes and I can never find what I'm looking for when I'm looking for them so I really like that I made like a separate area for my workout clothes So now I'm just going to start putting all of my clothes back in the closet. I'm kind of organizing my shoes and slippers that I put on top. I put my sandals and my slippers on top of those shoe bins. Um, I'll try and remember to link those shoe bins for you as well. I got the idea from Ashley from Till Vacuum Do Us Part, but I absolutely love them. They're from Walmart and they just make the closet look so much nicer. So I got everything back in the closet and basically I did sleeveless shirts right there with a, which I have almost none. And then I did right here is 
all of my short sleeve shirts. And then those are my kimonos. And then this is all long sleeve shirts. And then it goes into sweatshirts and jackets. So, so now whenever I come in here during this time of year, I'm already sweating right now. So this makes me really happy because I feel like I've been trying to find shirts to wear and I just can't find anything because it was color coded and I couldn't figure out where my t-shirts were. So these are my t-shirts and my short sleeve or my tank tops. So I just feel really good about this. So I'm just basically listing all of the things that we have over here in this pile. Some of it was from today and some of it was from the last time I decluttered my closet. And so I'm just gonna be trying to get things to look really nice. Some of my tips for selling on Poshmark are basically just get really good lighting, try to get like a neutral background and just try to make things look as clean and clear as possible. And then I just um, take the picture and I write the description and the title and how much it costs and like any of the details, like all of those things. So it's super easy. Like it doesn't take very long to post um, each item. So yeah, that's what I was working on. Okay, so I just finished uploading all my clothes onto Poshmark and I'm super excited for you guys to scroll through my closet. I'll make sure and have my handle listed down below. And once again, thank you to Poshmark for sponsoring today's video. I absolutely love Poshmark and we all know that I use it all the time. So super excited to be working with them on this video. Hopefully you guys can find some things that you liked and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.